No, this is um, Vivian. Um, so this is a video to sh help you uh, figure out how to blank out a field and um, doing it with no JavaScript. So what I did was assume you were sending an HL7 in and then wanted to send an HL7 out and you wanted to modify what was going out. So if that's the case, I went into my destination and then I clicked Edit Transformer, right? And here's where I, um, I use the message builder to do this. And the cool thing about this is I don't have to write any JavaScript. But if you wanted to see the JavaScript, I have version 331 of Mirth. I have a tab here called Generated Script. You can see the, the uh, JavaScript here, but there's no need to. So what I did was uh, I created a new step, right? Um, change this to message builder. Uh, under message segment, you drag and drop your template, your outbound template. Under mapping, you drag and drop your inbound temp inbound message. And then the default value, in case everything else fails, you want to blank it. So that's easy. But if there's data in there, you can do this. Use single quotes, just like I did up top too, ADT1, because you know MSH13 contains ADT1. So you're telling it if MSH13 contains, contains ADT1, then replace it with a blank. And I did that by single, um, single quotes. And then I just called this blank out MSH. 13, right? It's the same exact thing as what I did up here. Yep. So, let's go ahead. Delete this. Let's run it so you can see it. Okay, and this is all done by using templates. If you use templates, um, uh, you can get away with not coding JavaScript. Um, I do have another video if you want to use JavaScript. I'll send you that link too, but I'm thinking you may want to not use JavaScript, but here you go. Let's run this example. So, Blank out, no JavaScript. Let's deploy it really quickly. Just want to grab a message, get rid of all these messages. Just trying to do this quickly for you. Uh, send the message. Here's my message with your mess with your, the MSH header you gave me, and here's MSH 13 ADT1. I'm going to process that. So what I, we're going to see on the outbound is nothing in MSH 13. As you can see, it came in. MSA 13, I'm going to click my destination, and all I care about, I don't care about what happened over here right now, I care about what happened to sent. And now you can see in sent that my MSH 13 is blank. And that's it. Um, and that's how you blank out a um, field. Hope this helps. Bye.